Hey, John, we just wanted to wish you a happy retirement. Um, I still feel like, along with Dick Crabtree, that you're retiring too young. But uh, hey, who am I to say? <laughs> I just want you to know how much I've appreciated uh, having you around and getting to know you over the last many years and just having you a part of the ministry of the South Pacific and uh, just really thankful for your friendship and your partnership in ministry and just look forward to hearing about how your retirement goes and also look forward to just seeing you in New Zealand on a social basis and not through uh, through work. And uh, just look forward to uh, many more years of friendship with you and just wanted to thank you for the ministry that you've done and the recruiting and the encouragement that you've given the teams here in Australia and New Zealand. Absolutely. And now that you're retired, you can bring Gwen with you to New Zealand. We look forward yeah. to seeing you both. Love you. Happy retirement. John F. Woodward, the man with a presidential name and a presidential career in missions. May, by that, I just mean reputable, uh, respectable, a man who is in, has integrity and character and uh, we appreciate you. We thank you for all that you've done uh, for the Lord in your, your time, in your career. And I know that you're, you're not done working for him, uh, but we look forward to hearing about all your tra travels and adventures with Gwen in retirement. And uh, Whitney and the kids and I just want you to know we love you and we look forward to seeing you again soon. Come visit us in Aotearoa, New Zealand. Love you, hey, mate. John, congratulations on the retirement. You have earned it, brother. I hope it goes really well for you and you just and really love this time. Hey, John. Greetings from Costa Rica. The Baileys just wanted to take a minute to say congratulations. We are so proud to know you and, and to have you as a friend and, and proud of your years of ministry. And we are just really hopeful that your retirement means much more frequent visits uh, for you and for Gwen to Costa Rica. So you know where to find us. We can't wait to see you again and congratulations. Love you. Hey John, this handsome guy and I wish you a happy retirement. He would be here with me, but he's already asleep in the bed. Um, so I hope that your retirement can look a lot like this. Lots of fun, carefree days um, with grandkids and together with Gwen and your children. Um, and also, I know that just because of the short time I've spent with you and Gwen, um, I know that you'll be intentional in whatever you do, even in your retirement. Um, loved getting to sit across from you guys at dinner time or lunch time in Italy and um, just appreciate how you engage in conversation and how intentional you are. So I know that you'll carry that into retirement and um, you will continue to deeply care about relationships, whether that's with your kids and grandkids or with others that you're meeting along the way. Um, God bless you. Hey, John, on the occasion of celebrating your retirement, we've dialed up some weather that you may be more used to than we are. So, so glad you could join us. Um, gosh, so many things I could say, but John, I just want you to know that um, I'm grateful for you. Um, I know that as a missions team that we try to, to pour into people, but you've been so great pouring into us and especially to me, I just feel like from the first time that I met you and you first started coming to Shreveport and just hanging out with us, you've just always been so encouraging. Um, you know, I might've been having these little mini pity parties that you didn't even know about concerning like family and parenting, but um, you just always had an encouraging word to say at just the right time for me. So you may not know that, but I've always noticed it, and I want you to know that. Um, just thankful for your heart, your spirit. Um, and now that you're retired, no excuses. Time for Gwen to come to Shreveport. So uh, we love you. Enjoy all the things. Hi, John. Um, congratulations on your uh, retirement. I have to admit I'm a little bit uh, jealous, <laughs> but hopefully now you and Gwen will have the opportunity to come and visit us in Romania a little bit more. Uh, we can go see castles and we can drink coffee together and talk about uh, all the, the good old days in Romania. Um, so it would be it would be really fun. But congratulations. May God bless you. And 
Um, may this new season just be filled with love, joy, and peace, but above all, just a lot of peace and a lot of joy uh, because you've done a really, really good work. And um, I hope you'll be able to look back and just be really, really thankful um, and proud of the legacy that you're leaving behind. We love you. Happy retirement, John. We are so proud of you. I just pray that uh, you enter in retirement and able to enjoy and uh, be relaxed and refreshed. And I know God still has things for you. Um, and I just can't wait to see what happens next. Be blessed. Congratulations, John, on your retirement. Uh, we are so happy for you and can't wait to see what the future holds. And just want you and Gwen to know how much we love you. <laughs> Sorry, almost <laughs> dropped the camera. <laughs> John, brother, we want you to know that you are one of our very favorite people on this whole planet. We're glad you're part of our lives. Love you, brother. Love you. Привет, Джон. Hi, John. Мы хотим тебя поздравить. We congratulate you with your retirement. С, э, со счастливым выходом на пенсию. We are so happy for you. Верим, we believe, что это будет огромным благословением для тебя. This time uh, it will be great blessing for you. Что у тебя появится много времени свободного. And now you will have much more time, free time. Ты сможешь больше видеть родных и близких, друзей. Much more time for your family, for friends. У тебя появится больше времени для написания христианской литературы и книг. Much more family for writing your Christian books. У тебя появится больше времени для евангелизации. For sharing gospel with people all around you. У тебя появится больше времени служить ему, нашему Христу. And you will have much more free time you can use for serving our Jesus Christ. Мы тебя благословляем, очень любим. We bless you and love you so much. Очень ценим. We appreciate you. Ты огромное благословение для нашей семьи. You are a big blessing for our family. And I want to uh, add something that, uh, you know, we have met several times. And every time uh, we, me and Igor, we had feelings in our hearts that we, uh, it seems that we have known each other for years. And I think it because of we are in one body of Jesus Christ and we have one spirit in him. So it was very uh, it was very good to see you every time. And I hope we will see you again many times, maybe in Russia or somewhere in the world. So we love you. Bye. Hey, John. Hey, John. Happy retirement. We're so happy for you. <laughs> and a little bit envious. <laughs> uh, we're so happy that you are going to get to enjoy some retirement with your bride and with your family. You get to do whatever you want to do. Amen. I know you have uh, travel plans and seen many people. And uh, we can't wait to see you soon. And... Uh, yeah, we hope that you really, really enjoy your retirement. I know that you have sown the seeds of the gospel into many lives over mm -hmm. the, your years of service. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. John, on behalf of the doctoral program at Portland Seminary, our team is excited for you as you shift to the next season of your life and service to the Lord. Congratulations, Congratulations John. John. Hey, hey, John. Dr. John. I just want to say congratulations on your retirement. Man, what exciting new adventures the Lord has in store for you. And uh, man, you're a man uh, to look up to. Of course, because I'm only 5'5 five, five and you're like 6'20 something, you know. But uh, <laughs> I want to just say, man, my roommate from London and we started our program together. Here is where we have come. 
you are retiring and moving on to new adventures. I wish you all the best, my brother. I love you. May God give you continual riches in favor, peace, love, and joy. Love you, John. Bless you. Hey, John Woodward. You got me here in my... Uh bundled up for below freezing wind chill temperatures, snow and, and an ice storm coming um, within hours. It's been an exciting time here in the Pacific Northwest, but not as exciting as your time. Um, because this little video isn't about me, it's about you, isn't it? And it's about you because you are embarking in this new, next new adventure that we call a re retirement. And I have a feeling retirement will not mean sitting home and learning to crochet. Uh, John, I want to thank you for who you are. You're a humble man of wisdom and integrity who is kind and generous, uh, who is a man who people around you feel comfortable. I remember when we went out to Shreveport for Ashley and Chris's engagement party, and it was like you were just a part of the family there. You knew all the people. They welcomed you with open arms. You were just comfortable in your own skin. And I think that is a remarkable quality because in that space, you build relationship and trust. And you share your learning and your wisdom. And I have every confidence that that's exactly what you're going to continue to do as you move into retirement. No, maybe you won't have a formal title and ministry role, and yet God's going to continue to use you because it's who you are. Um, I am appreciative for, of you and the, the, the privilege of going through our doctoral program together, and I am praying for God to cover you with his cloak of protection, to guide you in wisdom, to fill you with his peace, and in all things, offer you blessing and hope. Love you so much, John. John, congratulations. This is a short video celebrating your retirement. And in a way, we ought to call retirement renewal, especially for those people whom the Lord is utilizing all around the world. I know that you will be given a second wind to go forward and to go forth to continue the kind of work that you and Gwen have been doing for so long. And I hope actually you're able to do it with a bit more energy now, a bit more freedom, uh, maybe unhindered in some ways by the fiduciary responsibility, the weight of the world that has probably been on your shoulders in, in your previous positions. I hope that you're able to still do all the good that you would hope that you might do, that you, as you take the next steps and I imagine for you, those are going to be next flights as well and, and continue onward in the faith, doing the kind of work, being the kind of person that you always have been. So, John, the Lord bless you. The Lord keep you, make his face to shine upon you. Thanks for having said yes faithfully for so many years. And I know you'll continue to do so. I'm just celebrating the freedom in which you'll be able to do that coming up. Congratulations. Hey, John, this is supposed to be a video about your retirement. But in my opinion, um, you can never retire from being my dear brother in Christ. Um, uh, you have been such a joy and you've been such an integral part in my life over the last four or five years. And so that's not going to change. So... <laughs> You may not be uh, flying as much or working as much, but um, uh, your role with me is not going to change. I love you, brother. Happy, happy retirement. Happy, happy retirement. <laughs> happy, happy retirement. Happy retirement. <laughs> it seems like just yesterday we were in London in an elevator. But even more importantly, we went on a walk. And we had such a great time walking and getting to know one another in Kensington Gardens. And I will forever remember that day, along with the wonderful beverage we had at the pub following that time together. But John, God bless me when he put you in my life. And I am forever thankful for that day in 2013 and for the many, many, many adventures we have had 
all over the world since then. So thank you, God, for John Woodward. And thank you for the friendship that we have had for this 10 going on 11 years. I hope and pray that we have at least 10 to 11 more years uh, ahead of us and even more than that, if God is willing. So we love you so much. Happy retirement. Bye, buddy. Molly, do you, do you want to say happy retirement, Uncle John? Happy retirement, Uncle John.